When patients are struggling with their eating and drinking, perhaps during treatment or after they've had surgery, this can lead to a little bit of stress in the house when a well-meaning carer is being a little bit pushy with eating and drinking. It's always done in the right in, with the right intention. Um, people want to feed each other, that's a natural part of life. What I would say though is to try and limit the amount of tension around food because that can make it worse if you are struggling with a poor appetite and you feel like you're being nagged. Offer food regularly, put it down but don't be cross or make too much comment if somebody doesn't eat what you've given them. Try them regularly with their favourite foods um, but try not to discuss what they're going to have at the next meal time when they're still eating the meal previous because that can be really difficult for somebody who's struggling with their appetite. Also as a carer if you're finding it difficult don't worry about using convenience foods, you can get ready meals, you can get pre-prepared foods, that all is really nutritious as well and can help take off some of that pressure of preparing food. Make sure you take a little bit of time for yourself as well, get out, get some fresh air, get a little bit of exercise just to make sure that you're looking